Hey guys, it's uh, Woody down the lane here again. Uh, in that little chat time. Give us updates on some projects going on. Uh, punch bug that's on stall right now. Try to get the stuff to make some windshield glass and everything. I'm working on the street burner. I got the suspension glued in. I got the wheels on it. <coughs> Doing some detail work with the end and putting hoses, stuff like that in it. And then I got to buff the body out. I got a little fingerprint, which I'm not, not sure you can see it. Oh, no. Okay. Yeah, right there. You see it? I don't know how I mean. Yeah, I thought it was careful. Not touching it while it was too dried good, but I'm going to try. I'm going to buff all that out. Polish it. Getting together slow. Take my time. I got a few more things painted up, drying. Final assembly part. That's the, that's all. Always gets you. Gets me, anyways. Took the day off from work, or the night rather, because I'm a night shift guy. Anniversary with the wife there. We went out and did a little shopping, went to the hobby store. I was going just to look around. We got a little hobby store called English's Model Rail. A lot of trains, a few cars. Wife got me some stickers. These are rat rod stickers. Poke of them. They got some crazy looking things on here. They got one little, little emblem that says, in, in rust we trust. I got a kick out and I seen that. They got the pinup girls. Go on my rat, one rat rod if I ever build one one of these days. And... She surprised me a lot. She got got me a Mobius 1956 Chrysler 300 Bay. I tore the plastic. I took it out. I was looking at it. Really nice kit. I like it. There's another one, blue one. I guess she said we're back down tomorrow and get me that because she'll get me a boat. She wasn't sure. Then she changed. I said go down tomorrow and pick her up. Greatest wife in the world. I mean, it's a really nice kit in the plastic. I'm gonna... Just looked at her all. I didn't see much much flash on it so far. What I looked at without you know in the plastic still. Chrome. I like it as the chrome when they put her on. Even the chrome looks pretty decent. Uh, no, oh, chrome looks good. But they separate between plastic so they didn't scratch one another. Two different style wheels. Believe. Yeah, not sure. Yeah, two different style wheels. Ah, uh, instructions, man, they're awesome. You guys have done Mobius, you've seen it the first time I've seen them. I mean, really nice laid out instructions. Nice paper, almost like a little book. And it gives you paint and all, like what everything looks like painted. I gotta get some paints, uh, some couple paints I ain't sure about yet. They give you a decal location on there for everything. Paint chart, gold. I'm not sure about. Yeah, you know, I can tell you how to mix your paints here. Like your flat, off white, some flat white with a random tan. I'm not sure what that is. And your test is metallic gold. I got to see what I got for gold if that's metallic. 
free engine covers, valve covers. Let's use flat, flat rubber paint for the bumpers. Or belts, rather. Sorry, belts. But really nice kit. And the other, there's another one like it. It's uh, like a light blue doors open. Actually, that one she's going to get me. I'm going to get that tomorrow. I'm going to look for some paints while I'm down there. Yeah, good woman. Take care of me. Sports a man's hobby. But, I mean, the box is nice. Gives you a lot of side, rear view and side view on the whole thing. A little one, one side at the front view. I like the white walls. Really nice white walls. Not chintzy looking. Skill level three. But, Get the other one, get some a couple more paints. Only direct TV lets you watch NFL Sunday ticket games live on all your devices. But here's uh also on the bugger boo, the other pod you got me running. I got the frame painted red. With uh craft X paint art, transparent red. First I painted a uh, metallic silver. Super color metallic silver. And I thought one over the uh, red, it like kind of shines, but transparent. Kind of put too much on or just how it goes. But all right, red frame's cool with me. I'll gloss clutter once it dries a little more. Get it nice and shiny. And here's a piece of resistance. My second layer of paint on the body. Little stand I've been making. Uh, I've seen the first time I seen these was uh, I believe it was Roadhog. He had one. He gave set old what he used. So I made one up, made two. First one, I had to make a new one because the first one was too wide for the body. When I painted it, after I got the blue on, she slipped off of the, swung off the spring, down on the ground. I had a little scuff mark here. Where I had to pick it up and the fingerprint there, then over here. A little speck of dirt was the only spot. It hit the ground, tumbled down like that, or down, rolled a little bit. But I got her sanded down. I'm gonna shoot her another with another coat of blue again, retape her off. But I love these little stands. I'm gonna take it off. For these ends here so it doesn't scuff up the paint or anything on the inside i'm gonna get some heat shrink tape slide on the heat shrink it on so that it holds them fast you know keeps it from going it might keep this from staying in place better but that's on that it's my projects right now i got the engine in the box i got that painted block painted i got a clear coat to block paint the transmission start that Uh, updates on everything. I'm gonna take all the chrome. I got like all the chrome pieces for this for the punch bug. I got all glued together. I don't like the seam line. I'm gonna strip all the chrome off and repaint everything, rechrome it. I'm gonna take and rechrome her all. And I got the spat. Or hold on a second, I'll put you down here. All right, guys, doodling. I got the. Spastex mirror chrome I'm going to use. The re-chrome it all.
I really like that chrome. When we call my scene, Hunter Shelby use that. I'm gonna give it a whirl. Yeah, the guys use it too. I know there is. I've seen them. They thought I could think of it right offhand. Back up on stand, guys. Ah, I got my ball from PP now in my my light up here. My magnet light. Seems a lot brighter. Well, it seems it is a lot brighter. I still got my other shop light with this shot or the, the steel body around it. Clip one up. Give me a little more light. You see, better do better work that way. Well, all right, I'm gonna make this a little short, guys. A little video. Just wanted to give you a couple dates how things are going. Street burner. I know I'm still working gluing your order, getting ready, then getting your polished up for my nephew. Well, I didn't like. I don't know if you noticed it. it. Looks like the back wheels are too far back. Everything's lined in the pins, the pin locations. I don't know why it looks like they're further back than it should be. Front seems right. The back just seems like it's setting backwards. <laughs> but, alright, well. That's it. Oh, here's, out, here's a little out to Tom. Tom, I suggested the wife about that model, that truck, uh, the alley rat for Christmas. She said that ain't happening. Not right now. So it comes down later, cheaper down somewhere, I'll go get it. But other than that, the Christmas idea was a, was a long shot. But I'll wait and get one later on. It'll come down. It'll come down somewhere. Someone will have one selling it and I'll pick her up. All right, guys. Hey, everybody take her easy. It's so way down the lane. Keep the styrene flowing, fellas. See you all later.